subchondroplasty is a newer type of procedure that we have that we did not have in our armamentarium in the past. In the past, we would see lesions, we call them bone marrow lesions, on an MRI. And on the MRI, the lesion would look white in the normal black bone. So the bone is supposed to look black on the MRI and we see these white lesions. And we used to call them bone bruises or edema, things like that. And it turns out they're actually stress or microfractures. Bone has millions of pressure sensitive nerve fibers in it. And what we see is in patients with arthritis, we always thought that their pain was coming from the cartilage wearing down. And we neglected to realize that on the MRI, these lesions that we thought were just quote unquote bone bruising or edema, swelling, were actually what was causing the pain. And then Dr. Sharkey, who's actually from Fulton, New York, he came up with a procedure called subchondroplasty. So basically it's a biologic internal fixation of these stress fractures. We're not using plates, screws, cement, we're using a biologic material. Bone is made from calcium and phosphate. So it's a calcium phosphate bone substitute. It comes as a powder. One of my assistants will mix up this powder with some saline or some blood. We usually we just use salt water, saline, and with the powder, and it becomes almost like a toothpaste consistency. So we're able to actually pull that material into a syringe, multiple syringes, and we're able to screw the syringe onto the hollow drill and inject the material into the bone where the problem is. And these bone marrow lesions are the bones a little softer, so the material will follow the path of least resistance and fill in these lesions. So then after 10 minutes, the bone substitute, the AccuFill, sets, and once it sets, it's as hard as your own bone. So basically what we're doing is we're using a biologic material to fix and secure these bone marrow lesions, these stress fractures, and once they're fixed, the pain goes away. And I have patients who come in literally the next day and they say, my bone pain's gone. They still have some pain from the arthroscopic portion of the procedure, but their bone pain is gone. It was like night and day. Um, I don't have pain now. I can put pressure on that leg. Right after the procedure, I could put pressure on the leg. I had crutches that I bought especially for the procedure. I didn't need them. The procedure lasted, I believe, about an hour and a, and a half. It was outpatient surgery. So I went in in the morning and I came out in the early afternoon. Everything was uh, as ex exactly as I expected them to be. Three weeks out, I could probably go dancing and that I don't think he'd be happy if I did. <laughs> he keeps, his biggest thing to me is take your time. And I'm so excited not to be in pain. I just wanna go, go, go.